terrific night of hockey here. Eddie Olchek is alongside. You'll hear from Ray Ferraro in a moment. I'm Mike Emery. Tonight, we bring you a matchup between two great teams. Rinkside we go now, and here is Ray Ferraro. I expect this to be a terrific hockey game. You've got two teams that can really play the game. They're fast, they're physical, and it's often just a bounce that separates teams like this. As we begin, Jonathan Huberdeau is a guy to watch for. Highly skilled, quick, and clever. Along with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, I'm Mike Emmerich, and this playoff game is underway. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Oh, how can they miss that pass? Good intercept. Ahead on that left wing, DeMarkov. Onside. One-timer. You can almost count that one, but no. And we're happy to have Ray Ferraro with us as well. He is down near the ice. Cleveland's focus in game two is to come out much quicker than they did in game one. They trail in this series 1-0. You sure don't want to go down two. Face-off win here. On to Pasternak. Muscled down to one knee. Cleveland's in possession as they travel up the wing. Slides it to the point. One-timer, the glove like lightning. Clean win on the draw. Chipped up the wing to Domi. Nicely into the zone. Fires a shot. Just couldn't find the target. From that position on the ice, he's got to hit the net. Make the goalie make a save. Good job on that faceoff, tying the man up. And thrown down to Domi. Looking to Henrique. Right up the middle through the neutral zone. Picks it up in his own end. Passing one off now to Domi. Moved along and in. Laid on to Tolusti. Front of the net! Feeds the point. Scooped up. Good work with the stick. Retreats into the defensive zone. Wonderful block. He covers and holds on. Over nine minutes skated here in the first. Both teams are still looking for their first strike. Tie up there and a good reach and possession. Gains the blue line. Oh, did he ever get matched? Manson's the type of player that responds to this type of game. It's going to be aggressive from start to finish, and his team wants to have the upper hand. Nice tip of the pass. Has it picked up. Let's a shot go. Terrific save with no reaction time whatsoever. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? Nicely into the zone. And he's hammered. That is one solid thump, Doc. He went right over top of him. The building erupted. Shoot. Price helps his team by covering up. This is the way you eliminate a player in the middle of the ice. Perfectly executed. Defensive zone win. 
Chip to Andrea. And possession has changed. Brilliant move on that pass. Shoots. Oh, what a save. Skill play by Shea Weber. The Knights look to make a difference up the wing. Big hit. Possession gone. Oh, and what a tremendous job of keeping the puck alive. Knocked to a knee. It's loose. Couldn't get through there. Columbus in control of the puck up the wing. That play went offside. Carey Price has owned one of hockey's most pressured jobs. Goaltender for the Montreal Canadiens. Great size for Carey Price. Six foot three, 210 pounds. You talk about a pressure job. Maybe as tough a job in the National Hockey League to be the starting goaltender for the Canadians. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. And they are in. The pass is off the mark. What a chance that would have been. Solid glove save. Puck covered, whistle blown. Quick work on the faceoff. Shoots. Got that in the trapper. Oh, if you're a shooter, you don't want to see the goaltender flash his glove like that. Good clean win on the draw. Gives it on a cross from the point. Takes that pass up the boards and stays. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Now it's directed to Seidenberg, trying to go to Palmieri. And the possession taken by Cronwall. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Moving it to Jordan Stahl. Can't get a shot on it. First period has come to an end, and the goalies dominated this period of play. That's why the score you see has zeros. Don't miss the chance to see the greatest talents in the world when they visit our city. See the official arena website for details on upcoming concerts. Columbus has remained in this game thanks to their goaltender. You want an example? Look at this one. Just one of many as we had to break. We are in the early stages of this game, about to begin the second period. Your thoughts on the first? Not a lot of shots by either team, Doc, in the first period, but I like the way that they both ended that period, so let's see if that continues here in the second. Pitching it to Oshie. Carried through the neutral zone, right up the middle. Gets across, looks over his options. Great stick work prevents the pass from being complete. Play to be made now by Spurgeon. Fast attempt to Oshie. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. To Kuznetsov. Shoots! Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. Not a lot of room to score from in that area. Great save. Carried on. Dumped in. Player changes, this time just the forwards. Out of their own end, making headway. Slid, got his glove on it. Jostled off the puck. Led on, DeMotto. Terrific save with a pad. This is overwhelming. Up the boards with it now. Waits with it, skates it down the wall. Pass off the mark. Score! Finally, we have a goal. Goal scorer right in front. It was tough for the goaltender to pick up the shot off the backhand. Once you drop into that position, you feel like you've got the bottom of the net covered. He doesn't as the puck gets underneath his glove as well. 
Columbus has gone ahead by a single goal, despite the fact they've been carrying the play constantly. Good help for the center by number 13, Jonathan. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Flings it. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. Six minutes, six seconds. Propelled to Seidenberg. On to Henrique. Great defense. Hangs on to it. And on to Cronwall. Pass across at the point. Forks it to Jenner. Terrific interception. Condor forced another turnover in this game. Let's see what they can do with it. The puck is free, now taken up by Boschum. Snapping a pass to Jenner. Laid on to Faxa. Fires. Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a face-off right near him. Larkin's played so well for the last little while. His point streak is stretched out again. Guys, you've been talking about him all night, and we've seen why he's been such a prolific performer. The Knights win it. Oh, what a play. Locks on that to Jelen. At the point of drive. Hot blues knocked down to a knee. Pitching this one to Jokinen. Good quick poke check there. Puck is thrown to Jordan Stahl. He's in on an onside play. A cutty stick on it. Cleveland's on the move in neutral ice. Save! That one is pointed to him. Good control right off that hit. Outstanding glove save. Columbus can't expect another save like the one we just saw. Their goaltender came up large to bail them out. Just over six minutes left to go in the period. Only one goal hanging on the board so far. So it's 1-0. Oh, and he is drilled. Weber's going to have to gather himself after taking that hit solidly. He was not aware where everybody was. Cleveland's organizing back in the defensive zone. Into the attacking end. What a hit. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Columbus moves to the neutral zone. Mashed in. Directing that one to Spurgeon. To Weber. Looking to Andreoff. It's dumped in. The Condors in their own end ready an attack. Passing one off now to Markov. A shot. Got a piece of that one. Cleveland's carrying it in their own end. Gives it over to the point. One timer. Score! You could really see this goal coming as a result of the pressure that they had for a long period of time. I think the players on the ice were just out of gas. Once the turnover's made, too many guys are heading one direction. The dangerous man is behind them, and it's a perfect shot inside the post. Columbus has increased their lead to two to nothing. At the rate they're firing shots, it might skyrocket. By number 88, the Knights looking to head man up the wing. 51, and by number 13, Jonathan Uberno. Time of the goal, 18 minutes, 44 minutes. Swept on to Seidenberg. Shoots one. Hey! He got that one, too. I thought the second was the toughest. And this period is over. Wow. Osternock's goal took it from a one-goal game to a two-goal advantage. Intermission is next.
40 minutes down, at least 20 minutes to go. What are your thoughts so far? Cleveland's had very little time of possession, Doc. They've been outplayed in that category big time, but they're still in this game. One shot, and they're right in it. It is the third period, and we are underway. Can he send it out? To Kuznetsov. Huge hit. Possession's gone. Almost out of nowhere, the defender steps into him. That hurts. Enormous collision. Weber's ability around the league is eye-catching. Oh, what a stop. The goalie makes himself look big. It's an onside play. A shot. Great save, point blank. Job tying the man up on the faceoff. Teammate comes in. They score! It's only a one goal game now. Spurgeon follow through on a slap shot, helped him score from the point. Price really struggled to catch up to the speed of that shot, Edzo, as you mentioned. What a rocket. Cleveland's deficit is only one because of that last goal. Let's see if they can tie it up here in the third. And they've won the faceoff. Scored by number 46. Nice pass right up the gut. Assisted by number six, Shane Weber, and by number 75, TJ. Nap by Gardner. Out in front. Score! He's got his second. Huberto stick was in a ready position to accept that puck and put it in as a one-timer. Really good positioning. He's in the butterfly where he's got most of the net covered, but there's obviously a hole in the pucks behind him. The Condors have struck for another goal. They've built a two-goal lead here early in the third period. All of hockey life is timing, and theirs is terrific. Knocked to a knee, lost it. On through the corner. Chip to Jenner. Got it at the point. Glove. Oh, that puck just hit his glove. Oh, you know he's happy, guys. He's sitting there on the bench. He's got a couple of goals in his back pocket already. But you know he's thinking about number three. What an achievement that would be to bang in one more. Face off, he ties his man up, and so the puck goes to his team. Moving along through the neutral zone. Gets in, what'll he do? Terrific open ice hit. The defense can rest. You have a hit like this, there will be more to follow. Terrific glove save. Down to ringside we go yet again. Ray, what do you know? Huberto's had several opportunities to shoot the one-timer. He's got an excellent release. Eventually, it pays off. Okay, Ray, he is a special player to watch. A little under seven minutes play. Just recently, another goal, and so the lead is two. They win it. Enormous hit. Denied by the defense. Puck loose. Blocked away. That's a good solid hit. He'll feel that one. Slid to Seidenberg. The Knights love the puck in their own end. It's dumped back in so the defense can come off and get a rest. Carried toward the woodwork by Ponick. Gathered up again by Cogliano. Now it's directed to Baxa. The Knights in possession as they travel through center ice. Propelled to Spurgeon. Got it all. That was all positioning right into his glove. Hayes closes the gap here quickly. Delivers this huge hit shoulder to the chest. Textbook.
possession established. Good reach there. Making progress through the neutral zone. Gets in. What'll he do? Nicely received at the point. And at an angle, snapped out of the air. up but a good reach and a good step in there for possession he's got that pass at the point gets that one on a cross good use of the stick broke that pass up hard work here skate kick out of the scrum Huberto's back on the got in front of another one oh, with this puck being so close to that this is all a reactionary save Kicks and escapes by Oshi. Has that point pass as well. And the pickup. Up the wing and still with it. Collected by Spurgeon. Up the wing and moving well. Good place to shoot from. Looks from a corner. On to Donskoy. A good stick there, so no complete pass. Looking to headman up the wing. That's a good solid poke check. Cleveland's got possession along the boards. Let's it go. Blocked. Oh, that one hit someone on the way. Approaching the final minute in this game. Pad blocked. Nice save. Just to follow. Incredible non-stop action that now we got a face-off. They win the draw. Let's see if it pays off. Fires! Not a hard hit, but effective. It's lost. Net empty. That hit somebody. Oh, and he's hammered. I saw that play coming from a mile away. He is shut right off. Shot. Wonderful work in close and a brilliant save. Not often you're all alone in front of the goaltender from this area of the ice. Great save. Down to rinkside we go yet again. Ray, what you thinking? Price has flashed the leather both with his gloves and his pads. He's been exceptional throughout tonight's contest. Can't ask for much more than what we're seeing right here. He has been remarkable tonight, Ray. It's going to be one of my three stars of the game, maybe the first. A big win. Let's see what happens. Trying to go to Domi. And he continues with it up the wing. Two guys together with force. Big force. Seidenberg's always been a leader for his club, and now he's trying to push the rock up the hill as they get themselves back to within level striking distance. Carries it to the corner. Good hand to eye. And the reach of the stick. Great stick save. Slides it to Hayes. And a save. Shoot. Game over. Goal, you can breathe a little bit easier as the time runs off the clock. The playoffs continue with our next game. We hope you'll look forward to that one as much as we are. Meanwhile, for this one tonight, for Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.